because you're from Philly and like myself, you've seen Boots in the gym. Um, how good is he, in your opinion? He's the best gym fighter I've ever seen with my own two eyes. Ever. Wow. Ever. If he turned that into a real fight, if he turns that at the top level from what I've seen in the gym, he's going to win titles at 47, 54, 60, which only special fighters could do. He's going to be a Hall of Famer. And he's going to be the best fighter of the 2020s. He is that wow. good. He's a mixture of Roy Jones and Mark Two Sharp Johnson. I never seen him get beat up. and I never seen nobody get the better of him in back-to-back -back sparring sessions. And I've only seen him. I've only seen two people probably like walk away from a sparring session like, yo, he probably got the better of him that day. And that was like four or five years ago. I ain't seen mm. nobody get the better of him recently. Nobody. He's phenomenal in the gym. And I'm saying that in the gym because you still got to do it with the bright lights on, without hair gear and small gloves. But he's the best fighter I've ever seen in the gym. And I've been around the gym since the 90s. I've seen all of the best guys box. Melzick Taylor, Bernard Hopkins, anybody you can name of the last 30 years, I've seen him work in the gym. He's the best one I've ever seen in the gym, ever. Wow, and, and he's super consistent. Every time you see him box, always put on the show, no matter who it is. He can box three, four people, four minute rounds. He always, always in the gym. He lived like a fighter, totally dedicated. Best fighter I've ever seen in the gym. 